Alright, so I'm going to um, clear up some points that I made in a couple other videos that may not have been completely true, and this is about rendering blender curves in Yafere. Well, the first part is, yes, blender curves do render in Yafere, um, and I'll show that to you right now. So I'll create a circle, and then I'll create... Um, a Bezier curve and this is just going to be um, a bevel or what other programs might call a loft so Okay, so I have my curve set up here, and now if I render it, you'll see that it actually does render. Before, in previous videos, I had said that it doesn't, and that's because I had tried rendering a different type of curve, and it didn't work, and I thought that that was true for all curves. However, I will now clarify what will and what won't render in Yoffrey. As you can see, um, a beveled or lofted object will render in Yafere just fine. However, if I was to not loft this, pretend I want myself a nice column or something, if I do this and then try to render you'll notice I don't get anything absolutely nothing um, I don't know why this is but it's some blender you offer a communication that's not working because if I render this in blender you'll see that it'll render just fine um, besides the fact that it's black and you can't see anything so what we have to do is we have to figure out some way to get this to render well if you play around with something if you put that same curve in the taper place, um, you know, you're wondering, is it is it going to work? Because you know, bevel object worked, but just having a thing, um, just a normal cube, uh, not cube, a normal extrude didn't work. So if you put in the taper object, you'll notice it actually works, and it actually will render something that's been tapered. So now we know that a taper and a bevel work. So if we just want this to be extruded and not have anything done to the geometry, if you go about how to think about that, um, you might come up with uh, an idea like I did, um, and that is to simply have an empty curve, we'll name it empty, and assign it to either bevel or extrude. Um, if you assign it to bevel, you'll completely ruin your extrude. So just assign it to taper, you'll notice that nothing happens because it is empty, and then render it, and magically you can finally render your curves in Yafere without having to convert them to a mesh, which is uh, will save you time editing, and it'll also, um, it's easier, um, 
and it's quick. But remember, you do have to assign that empty to all um, curves that are not uh, lofted or beveled. I mean, bevel really isn't the right word, but that's just what Blender uses. Anyway, that's been another tutorial for you guys. Remember, you can check out more on my blog, bl4n.blogspot.com, and I also have all my videos here on YouTube. The blog does have more stuff, like um, articles on different renders and stuff like that, so go on over there and check it out, and more tutorials are on the way shortly.